Dogs are often referred to as man's best friend, but some breeds have a reputation for being more aggressive, just like the pit bull, and more dangerous than others, such as the German Shepherd. But first, let's meet this deadly furball. Number 10. Alaskan Malamute the Alaskan Malamute is a majestic and powerful breed of dog, with a wolf-like appearance, striking grey and white fur, pointed fluffy ears, and rather tall stature. This breed is among the oldest of canines, as their ancestors are believed to have crossed the Bering Strait from Siberia to Alaska, where they were first documented by the Malamutes, an Inuit tribe. It is a working dog bred for its strength and stamina to pull heavy loads on sleds. Despite its intimidating size, the breed is generally friendly and affectionate. However, if an Alaskan Malamute is not properly socialized or trained, it can become aggressive, displaying signs such as growling, snarling, or biting. This is usually a result of fear or insecurity and should be addressed quickly to prevent more serious problems. In fact, between 1966 and 1980, this type of behavior was responsible for five deaths in the United States. Number 9. Wolf Hybrids Wolf hybrids, also known as wolf dogs, are among the most controversial and ill-advised breeds in the world of dog breeding. The first ever wolf hybrid was the Saarloos Wolf Dog, which was created in 1932 by Dutch breeder Leendert Saarloos by crossing a male German Shepherd with a female European wolf. Saarloos intended to create a self-reliant house companion, but this experiment proved to be a mistake for many reasons. Wolf hybrids are difficult to manage and may not be suitable for most households. They can be more challenging to train and socialize than domestic dogs, and they may display behaviors that are not conducive to living near humans. In addition, wolf hybrids are considered wild animals due to their unpredictable behavior, increased aggression as they mature, and their predatory instincts akin to their wolf ancestors. The Humane Society of the United States reports that wolf hybrids were responsible for 19 deaths between 1982 and 2014, confirming the danger of having such animals as pets. Number 8. Dalmatian the Dalmatian, also known as the English coach dog or carriage dog, is a medium to large-sized dog with a short, smooth coat and distinctive black or liver-colored spots. This breed originated in the historic region of Dalmatia, Croatia, and was bred as a hunting dog. They are highly intelligent and friendly animals, but can be aggressive towards strangers due to their history as a hunting and war dog. Dalmatians are known for their stamina and endurance, as well as their need for plenty of exercise and attention. Without enough exercise, these dogs may become destructive. While Dalmatians are usually friendly and loyal to their owners, they have been known to be aggressive, even resulting in three maimings and attacks reported in the United States. It is important to remember that this breed was bred as a hunting dog, and they may act accordingly when they feel threatened. For this reason, it is best to socialize them properly and provide them with ample exercise and mental stimulation. Number 7. Doberman Pinches Dobermans possess a powerful bite force of 305 pounds per square inch, and their sharp, small jaws enable them to bite their victims in quick succession. Reports of Doberman attacks are generally categorized into three groups, strays, incidents involving children, and attacks between neighbors. When a Doberman or another large breed dog attacks, the injuries inflicted can be grave, potentially having long-term effects on the person who has been bitten. The victim may be left with deep tooth marks, puncture wounds, lacerations, and abrasions, necessitating a visit to the emergency room or urgent care facility for suturing. Doberman pinchers have a history of being bred to guard and protect, thus they can become aggressive in certain situations. Today, these dogs are loved by many as members of their family. However, their breed's aggression due to the purpose of their breeding has resulted in 23 attacks. 12 of them were children, 9 were adults, 12 of them were maimed, and 8 have unfortunately resulted in deaths. Number 6. German Shepherds German Shepherds are large and powerful dogs that can be dangerous if not properly trained and socialized. Without proper training and socialization, German Shepherds can become aggressive and territorial, making them a potential threat to people and other animals. They are also very protective of their owners and their property, so they may become aggressive if they sense a threat. In addition to aggression, German Shepherds can also be dangerous due to their strength. 
They are strong enough to knock down a person and their bite can cause serious injury. Because of their size and strength, German Shepherds should never be left alone with children or other animals. Owners should ensure that their German Shepherds are properly trained and socialized from a young age to ensure they remain friendly and well-behaved. Owners should also be aware that even with proper training and socialization, German Shepherds may still show aggression in certain situations. It is important to be aware of the risks and take the necessary steps to ensure that their German Shepherds are safe and not a threat to anyone. Number 5. Great Danes The Great Dane is an extremely territorial dog and can attack without warning, causing serious and life-altering injuries. If a Great Dane displays any sign of aggression or biting, it is essential to take the necessary precautions to ensure the safety of everyone around it. It is one of the largest dog breeds in the world, famously depicted as Scooby-Doo in the comic cartoon of the same name. It is of German origin. The Great Dane is an old breed bred by the nobility for protection and hunting games such as boar and deer. Unfortunately, aggression in the Great Dane is not uncommon, particularly when the dog is suffering from hypothyroidism or other health issues. In other cases, aggression is caused by mistreatment, trauma, or provocation. In 2019, the Great Dane was responsible for 37 attacks, 12 of which involved children and 9 of which involved adults. Tragically, three of the victims in the reported incidents passed away. Number 4. Siberian Husky there have been two infamous reports in which Siberian Huskies inflicted a fatal dog bite attack on a human, and they happened in Minnesota and Alberta, Canada. First, in February 2010, a Husky in Independence, Minnesota was reported to have jumped onto a bed where a newborn was strapped in a car seat, resulting in the first fatal dog attack. Animal control found no records of the Husky having been aggressive before, and the extent of the injuries the infant sustained is not known. Second, in April 2012, a female husky in Alberta, Canada escaped from its kennel, which had been specifically set up to separate it from a two-day-old baby. Even though the parents were aware of the potential danger the dog posed, it was still able to find its way to the infant and bite its head. Although the bite was not severe enough to kill an older child, it was still enough to cause the death of the newborn, who was crying at the time of the incident. And with that, it's now time for today's best pick. And wouldn't you know, we actually have three picks today, comprised of three dog breeds that many consider to be the most dangerous. Find out more about them next. Number 3. Pitbull Pitbulls account for only 6% of the canine population, yet they are responsible for 68% of all dog attacks and 52% of fatalities resulting from dog-related incidents since 1982. The findings of the report, published in the April 2011 issue of Annals of Surgery, are particularly concerning, as pitbulls are the most popular dog breed in the United States. According to the American Kennel Club, they have been the most popular breed since 2006 and have been in the top five since 1998. The report concluded that these breeds should be regulated in the same way in which other dangerous species such as leopards are regulated. As one person is killed by a pit bull every 14 days, two people are injured by a pit bull every day, and young children are especially at risk. This report was shared with Time by PETA, the world's largest animal rights organization. In South Africa, an extremely heartbreaking incident was recorded concerning a three-year-old boy. He was viciously attacked and mauled to death by two American pit bull terriers. The toddler had been playing outside with friends in a neighbor's gated front yard where the dogs were usually kept in a cage. Unfortunately, that morning they had escaped and were roaming the area. It wasn't until somebody poured hot water on the dogs that people were even able to take the boy's lifeless body away. The tragedy has left the community reeling and shocked at the brutality of the attack. Number 2. Chow Chow the Chow Chow is a powerful and independent breed that can be a daunting presence if not well trained and socialized. This breed is loyal to its family but is known to be aloof and sometimes even aggressive with strangers. If not properly trained, they may also demonstrate aggression towards other animals. Therefore, it's important to be aware of their potential for aggression and take appropriate steps to ensure that they are properly socialized and trained. They are a medium-sized breed of dog, typically weighing between 40 to 70 pounds. They stand between 17 and 20 inches tall at the shoulder. Their height and weight give them the ability to easily push a child over or attack them. 
According to Pet Helpful, there were 58 reported attacks involving this breed between 1982 and 2013 that resulted in personal injury. Of these, 37 of the victims were children, seven of whom died because of their injuries. In addition, 39 cases of maiming were recorded. Number 1. Rottweilers Rottweilers are territorial and extremely protective, and this type of behavior is what led to over 666 attacks in the US. 349 were children at the time, 210 were adults, and of these cases, 402 were maimed and 110 sadly perished from the incident. In one incident, a 14-year-old boy was attacked in Kanpur. He was brutally mauled by a Rottweiler as he made his way to school. The dog managed to tear a piece of flesh from his leg and he sustained injuries to other parts of his body. Fortunately, bystanders were able to intervene and save him. It has been revealed later that the dog had already attacked at least three other people in the same neighborhood. Such a vicious attack is a reminder of the need for greater animal control to prevent further incidents. Would you dare to get these dog breeds as pets? See you all next time.